officially of course Machiavelli and today we are back with another scenes full of speed build yes we're back. Wait, that makes no sense. I was here yesterday. I'm sorry. I'm acting like I haven't posted in like a year. I don't know. But uh, anyways, we're back with this people. And today, today, we are building a semi, well, it's kind of like, it's, it's, it's a mix between a tower house and a semi-detached. It's a semi-detached, but it's not even a semi-detached because it's, a semi-detached is when two buildings are attached together. And a townhouse is the same way too, but also townhouses don't have to be attached. I don't know, okay? You'll see by the title what the heck I called it. It's either going to be a townhouse or it's going to be... And semi-detached. It's one of those two. But I hope you guys do enjoy it because I I like it. I'm actually using it right now. And I actually made this for my, uh, made this for two things. One, I need it for an LP. And two, I need it for my current household. So I made one of these. And I, I feel like these are, like, I need more of these in handy because now that we have the roommates thing, I can now finally have, like, share housing because I've always wanted, um, you know, I've always wanted a place where, uh, or way where you could, like, have one person live in one house, and, like, you have two houses in the lot, but then one person occupies one house, the other people occupy the other house, and now with roommates, I can go ahead and do that, so I made two houses, so it's, like, semi-detached, I don't know, I thought it'd be, like, a cool way, so, like, it's, you're, you're, like, renting it, in a sense, so you're renting the house, um, but it's not like you bought it, you're renting the house, if that makes any sense. Um, but yeah, I don't know, it, it takes a bit of imagination, but I like it. And I'm really happy that we have those roommates thing now so I can make my imagination go wild. But anyways, there's that. And y'all want to hear the one, y'all want to hear the, okay. Y'all want to hear the crazy thing about this beard? Like, this is crazy. This is, this has hardly ever been done. Y'all, I'm not even kidding when I say this, this is crazy. But, um, I furnished this house. No, 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 no. I furnished this house both of them furnished except the basement furnished you guys be like well, what do you mean you always furnish it no no no. i mean furnished yep furnished i mean the downstairs is furnished the upstairs is furnished both houses downstairs upstairs no basement but you know what i mean the, the basement's furnished enough but y'all I'm so proud of myself. It took me, like, what, three hours to get this done? I did, like, what, one hour of building it and then three hours of, like, building both houses. It was it was a lot. And plus, I had some work to do at the same time. It was it was a mission, but I furnished it. Do they look amazing? No. Because one house, I tried to stick, like, the house. One of the houses, I tried to stick to CC bases, you know? Because that's going to be the house that the guests are going to live in, like, or say the roommates are going to live in. So I'm, I'm not going to live in that house, so it doesn't really matter. I want to look decent, you know? So um, one house is furnished. CC wise, not CC wise, furnished um, um, EA wise, and the other one house is furnished CC wise. So, <laughs> yeah, I can check this up, y'all. I'm proud of myself. Like, furnished, I'm talking about I furnished the bedrooms, the bathrooms, the kitchen, the laundry room, the dining room. Like, I furnished everything. This is, y'all, enjoy this while it lasts, because I don't know if it's going to happen again for a while. The only reason I furnished it, because I needed it. You know, that's why I don't furnish my other big ones, because one, um, I have no, like, like, I need, um, to furnish these houses, or furnish bedrooms and stuff, I need, like, a design direction. Like, I need to feel like booms are, like, based on the person's personality and I can't just make one off the bat. I have to make it for a sim if that makes any sense. And so that's what I did with my sim. Actually, fun fact though, um, I say fully furnished, but one of the houses is not furnished fully because, um, like I said before, this is apartment style and they don't have that much money <laughs> because if they, if, if they had enough money, I'd have them live by themselves, but they don't. So they're renting and so I didn't finish one of the bedrooms so the be upstairs doesn't look too hot the bathrooms are decent but the the bedrooms themselves oh god <laughs> I think about it now they're not that good but again that is totally up to you I'm right now I'm just making sure the bath the backyards are even so that's why I'm doing all that type of stuff so there's a backyard you have a little tiny front yard a little driveway you know all that all that good stuff so mm -hmm. I'm very proud of myself with this and just the fact that I furnished both of them <laughs> I don't furnish stuff. I love. Oh, anyways, they, they look and prompt, and also the EA ones. The furnishing is very ugly, <laughs> very ugly. I like I said, I'm. I literally just play stuff down. You know, you know what I used? <laughs> you know that thing in that gallery that like 
you like click it. It's like it's like a room box where you like click it and it shows you like furnished rooms. I used that to furnish the room. So that should so so if you thought that oh maybe he actually tried with the A stuff, no, I didn't. I used those furnished pre-made rooms and I just placed them down. So expect that. Um, the house that I'm talking about, it's like you see, I'm talking about all oh, it's furnished and now I'll think about it. I'm like wow, it's not even furnished that well. Like the room, the one that I'm actually living in, it has CC in it, but it's not fully it's not fully furnished because we're broke. So, you know, so see, so see, two options. You can either get a non fully furnished, like a non fully furnished house that looks pretty good, um, with the CC, or get a fully furnished house that looks pretty bad with um non custom content. You know, it's up to you. But um, it's on the gallery. You see, I'm even talking about this because, bro, I never furnish everything fully. This is this is this is a golden moment. This is history. This is this is historic right here. Actually, no, I actually did furnish um a whole um a whole. What was it called again? A whole... <laughs> I furnished a whole... Bruh, I can't remember the name of it. Dormitory. Yeah, I did that, that. It's on the gallery, by the way. Mm -hmm. Well, if you're wondering why not all my builds are on the gallery, well, listen, y'all. Um, <laughs> y'all. Well, listen, if you're wondering why all my builds are on the gallery, it's because one simple thing. My builds are ugly, okay? When <laughs> when I make apartments, I don't I don't furnish the, outs the exterior of the house, and they look really bad. And then when I go to add them to my gallery like they like the thumbnail is so disgusting i'm like i can't upload this to the gallery like i'm like the thing is though i normally don't care but then i kind of started like going on other people's channels just because i was like finding houses to do some stuff and i'm like god damn these look so nice and i look up and then i like i want to mine i'm like god damn what the flip marie malik like what is this what is this supposed to be a gallery huh. nah this is hell but honestly it looks so bad i was so embarrassed i'm like you know what i gotta fix this so now whenever the outside looks pretty fluggly i'm saying should say fluggly but when the <laughs> when the thumbnail doesn't look too good you're getting thought you're getting you're getting you're getting tray files as simple as that just and if you don't know what tray files are you just download them and you put them in your tray and your tray file in your game and it's on the gallery for you so it's pretty simple all you do is download and put your your, your, your tray files um, but um yeah so if, if the thumbnail looks ugly it's on the gallery it's gonna be tray files I'm pretty much gonna put tray files for all my builds no matter what because some people they don't have the gallery or the gallery doesn't work for them so tray files helps them out so I'm gonna do that for you guys but most of the times when I'm doing apartments, expect tray files. Unless I'm doing like an actual like city living apartment, then I'll put them in like um, the gallery under rooms because then I don't care because it's a room. But like, bruh, those 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 thumbnails be looking so bad. Like I was so embarrassed. But anyways, that's me. How y'all doing? Hope y'all having a great Sunday. Um, hope y'all are excited. I'm pretty sure Tiny Living comes out. I haven't even, I haven't even talked about Tiny Living. Um, about that pack and you would think I'd be so excited like yay tiny living but in all honesty it's whatever until I actually get my hands on it which I'm not gonna buy it I, I've come to the point where I'm like I'm not buying any EA pack full price it ain't happening unless it's an expansion pack and I'm making like an LP then but other than that no I, have, I haven't bought any of the game packs none of the new stuff packs I've, I'm missing those and I haven't really missed them actually I've, I've, I've there's a few things that I want out of each pack but not enough for me to bust down and spend some money so much money on it so um, I won't be getting the pack unless I'm gifted it which if I am thank you whoever gifted it to me but if I'm not then I'm not gonna buy the pack until it goes on sale and when I say I'm, saying, I'm talking about so it goes on sale for like what six bucks <laughs> one of those sales and then I'll pick it up but if not then I'm not gonna buy it I'm not so I'm most likely I'm not gonna get it but no who is gonna get it that was funny because I'm not gonna get it but one of y'all gonna get it because I have picked my winner for the giveaway and people are like what the frig are you talking about what giveaway well if you guys remember back in December I told you guys that I'm having a one day giveaway well if you well, I told you guys but if you watch the video or not if you're if you're a new subscriber then I apologize no I'll say I can't really apologize you weren't there but there will be more giveaways I've done more giveaways before there will be more giveaways in the future don't worry but I picked my winner from that one day giveaway thing um, and so I'll be announcing it on Tuesday for the lucky winner well I'll announce it after Tuesday or maybe on Monday it just depends like bro I'm gonna be busy <laughs> actually no Tuesday of the day off but I have to go in for school for something so anyways it depends if I have time or not if I upload that day or in anything if I upload that day then most likely you'll you'll know who it is but if I don't then you'll have to wait uh, but yeah I picked the giveaway winner for that I honestly thought it was gonna be for um I thought you know the pack that we all um we the pack that we all uh 
voted on. Well, you guys voted on. I didn't vote on anything. The fact that everyone voted on, I thought that was going to be the next pack. But I was I was sadly mistaken. It's this one. Um, my thoughts on it is, if you, if you want to hear my thoughts on it, is I'm not too impressed, <laughs> to be honest with you. The only thing I remember from the trailer, normally when it comes to trailers, I watch them over and over again. And the only thing I've seen from the trailer that I remember is, like, the Murphy bed, which is cool. But I'm not going to go out and bust, like, what, $16 on a Murphy bed? Like, are you dumb, son? I got priorities. That ain't one of them. Um, so, yeah, I'm I'm personally not too impressed. But, again, I haven't played the game. That's what I said about... um. I know people. I know people dog this this Alex Magic pack, but that's exactly what I said about um, what's it called again? Uh, get together. I thought get together would be stupid. Like, who wants a DJ? Who wants this type of stuff? Like, yeah, party and all that stuff. Five but it looks kind of boring, right? But nah, get together is one of my favorite expansion packs. Windenburg is literally one of the best, if not the best city we had. I I honestly thought it was gonna be um, that's that um, no 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 city. I'm starting to hate. I hate a lot. Um, that, 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 um, world we get with, uh, cats and dogs, bruh, it's always raining there, it's always so depressing there, like, bruh, I wanna live there sometimes, but, oh, like, with seasons, it makes everything look so depressing, like, sometimes I'm like, god, I don't really want seasons in my game, because, <laughs> because, like, on cloudy day, like, on cloudy days in The Sims 4, your game looks so depressing, you're like, you don't even wanna play, you're like, what are you gonna do on this day when it's, like, cloudy, and then, and also, in um, that stupid-ass world in Cats and Dogs, it rains every other day. <laughs> every other day it rains, and so my sims are always inside. I literally had to move my sim because I was like, I was tired of that world. I'm like, nah, nah, be. my sims are being antisocial. They're not getting no sunshine because it never suns here. Like, what is this? So, yeah, I had to go ahead and go ahead and let... Oh, yeah, I, I have a lot of trouble right now. I'm trying to figure out how, what I'm going to do. For, Cause I wanted three bedrooms upstairs. I was trying to fit like three bathrooms, but I was like, you know what? I'm just gonna get three bedrooms and live with that. That that's fine. I ended up doing that. All's good. Um, so it's three bedrooms, one bathroom. This is actually the guest house. I was gonna pick this as the actual house because it has, um, let's see, it has what? It has one bath? Has it has a bedroom downstairs with the bathroom? has an office upstairs with a bathroom, then it has three bedrooms upstairs with a bathroom, with one bathroom. So it has five bedrooms and, well, technically five bedrooms, four bedrooms and an office, but five bedrooms and three bathrooms, which is pretty good. Um, and then the other house has four bedrooms, has a really nice four bedrooms and, um, one, two, three, four. Four bathrooms. Four bedrooms, four bathrooms. So this one, you're getting more bedrooms. The other one, you're getting more bathrooms. And the other one has a really nice kitchen. Like, it has a dining room. The, that's the one thing that really stood out with for me. Like, if it was, if, if like, this house, I made it for um, a family. If I was, like, building it for just, you know, single Sims or, like, Sims that have no kids yet, then I would have definitely picked this house because... It just seems like a cooler house to me. I like I like I like the small living, but we had a family. Well, I was building it for a family, so I wanted a dining room. And this one has a dining room, but it doesn't have like a full fledged dining room like the other one has. So I ended up picking the other house. And I love the other house. It's really nice. It's just that like the mom's gonna have to live in the basement, which is fine. It it happens. I live in the basement and I love it. Actually that's a lie. I don't love it as much as I thought I would. It's it's really cold in the winter and it's really Actually, actually, no, that's a lie. I love the basement. In in the summer times when it's extremely hot outside, my base, like my room, is so nice and cool. So I, I ain't gonna diss the basement. But um, yeah, there's that. Oh dang, this 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 this, this blah, 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 blah. I I talked up a storm. I was supposed to do shoutouts today, and the video's literally almost done. That is crazy. This is what happens when you talk too much. But um. Anyway, so hopefully you guys enjoyed this build. I really liked it. I really enjoyed it. I'm pretty. I'm gonna be using this build a lot because now, like I said, now we have roommates. I actually want to build more room or more houses like this. Actually, comment of the day. Let me know. Do you guys want me to build more townhouses slash um, semi detached houses? I'm talking about houses with multiple houses on a lot. So like. Like, for example, this house, if you, if you guys want me to build more houses like this, I'll actually go on a building spree because I have a few lined up, but I look like, I said, I'm not, like, I'm, I'm gonna, I'm gonna build them. I don't know if I'm gonna build them on camera next time, because sometimes I like building stuff off camera. Um, but yeah, let me know if you guys will actually want to see me build more houses with, like, multiple houses on a lot, so that, um, 
so so that I can build them so I don't get no because I like size because sometimes like normally I'd like dive into the designing but no since I'm building other houses you guys have to watch me through the process of building them and then coming up with some layouts layouting is so effing hard like bruh <laughs> it is so hard to make a layout you don't understand like you might think it might be easy to come up with some proper layouts but you're trying to like utilize all the space it is something else but anyways let me know your opinions down below and of course I hope you guys enjoyed this video thank you so much for watching I love y'all and have a great Sunday. See you guys on Monday. Bye, guys. I'm out. Deuces. Peace. Later.